Hello my stars and galaxies, welcome back to my channel, The Universe Terror. Today we're doing a reading for Scorpio. Scorpio, it's all about you, it's all about the Scorpios today. Now before we get started, make sure you guys like, comment, share, 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 subscribe, 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 and hit that post notification bell so you don't miss an upload for when I upload. And please don't let the Terror Instagram page is in the description box below, along with my cash app so you know exactly where to go for whenever you're ready for a personal reading, alright? Now without further ado, let's get started. Hope you guys have a good morning, noon, and night, I hope all is well, but if all is not well, I do apologize, hopefully your situation will get better. Right? I know. You know, for me, I'm about to go to the park after this. You know, just get get some fresh air, you know? I've just been waking up, eating, working, going to sleep, waking up, eating, working. You know? So, how it's my day off now, I could just... I'm going to bring my dog with me. I'm going to bring my dog with me. We're just going to go walk around at the park. You know, I'm making sure I'm charging my Bluetooth before we leave. You know what I'm saying? You guys got to do that sometime. That's the, the, that's the message for the day. Is well, as busy as, you, as your schedule probably is, don't forget to just take a couple hours out of your day or just take your day off and just go outside, breathe in the fresh air, okay? Get out the workplace, okay? Even if you don't want to breathe out the fresh air, at least kick up your feet. Drink something like nice and cold or refreshing or something hot, piping hot and hits the spot. You know what I'm saying? That's my message for the day. <laughs> and that's not even for any specific zodiac sign. That's just for anyone who needed to hear that in general. Okay, so again, we're going to just draw 10 cards for Scorpio. Alrighty, so Scorpio, our first card says the Page of Pentacles, okay? I'm seeing here you've bumped into a financial opportunity, all right? Okay, maybe this could be like you're going to school and gotten financial aid, right? Or you've gotten a full-on scholarship, right? Or maybe you're working and you've gotten a big bonus or a big raise that's really going to bring in a lot of more income, you know what I'm saying? You know, it's just going to help you grow your um, your skills and bring open more doors of opportunity, and you're just going to enjoy it, all right? The Eight of Swords in the reverse, okay? You know, and you really needed this. You're glad that this happened to you because you've been trying to release negative negative thoughts in your mind, okay? You've been releasing those negative thoughts. Maybe you've been talking bad about yourself and you had low, because you had low self-esteem, you know, you just did not feel like you were worthy of anything good happening to you. Maybe there was a lot of bad things happening to you and you always felt some type of way, you know, you felt alone or lonely, you know, you just did not want to um what do you call it you did not want to feel that way forever so you're so you're glad you're finally getting some good vibes some good luck coming into your way all right and this is by that financial opportunity so you're trying to release those negative thoughts right to build back up your mental state the king of pentacles in the reverse okay but I'm seeing here, Scorpio, that sometimes you are obsessed with money and social status, okay? So you will spend money on clothes or, you know, um, what do you call it? It could be clothes or, you know, the cars, you know, you're trying to make people think, seem like, ugh, can't talk. You're trying to make people look at you and think, oh, wow, this person looks rich. They got a BMW or they got a Lexus or they got a Lamborghini. Like, like guys, guys, don't be so obsessed with social status, okay? Because at the end of the day, these people will look at you and think, oh, they got a nice car. And then that's it. That's it. They can't, all, they're gonna, all they can do is compliment you, but they can't, they don't know how much you're paying just to for all of that okay like yes they'll look, probably look at you and have good thoughts about how do you look or what you're riding or they'll be um they'll look at you and say hey i like your shoes or shirt or your jacket or your car or whatever the case is but you could have all that and be broke you could have spent all your paychecks on that and be broke okay so you're kind of obsessed with stuff like that the lovers okay so i'm seeing here that you're also trying to get the attention of a guy or a girl or 
both or a little bit neither. I don't know, then, because there's a lot of genders out there that's not male or female. So I'm trying to accommodate, all right? All right, you know, there's even non-binary and gender fluid. I, you know what? <laughs> it's a lot of keep up, okay? It's a lot of keep up with, so. But I try, though, I try. So, yeah, you're trying to get, there's somebody's attention you're trying to get by acting all cool and looking all rich. But, um, Scorpio, remember, they possibly don't even care about that, okay? Now, if they're obsessed with money, okay, if they're obsessed with money, then I don't think it's even a good idea to get their attention. Because when you run out of money, or if you run out of money, they will head for the exit, all right? But if they're not obsessed with money and social status compared to you, then, you know, trying to impress them with clothes... And, and, and materialistic things is not really the best way to go, okay? That doesn't buy love. Ten of Cups in the reverse. Because, see, if you do that, it's only going to end up in a unhappy, loveless relationship. I almost said marriage. I don't know why. But relationship, okay? Because you're trying to buy their love, okay? And they're not having it, okay? Or if they are obsessed with money, okay, and social status like you, and the two of you get together, it's going to be um, loveless because you're getting all this stuff for yourself and them. So they'll love you, okay? But they're never going to truly love you. They're only going to love the money that you bring in, okay? They're going to love the stuff that you have, okay? They're going to love your money, not you as a person, okay? So you have to watch out for that. The Ace of Swords. 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 I said swords. That's it. <laughs> Alright. So Scorpio, it's important to get mental clarity. Okay. And try to not be so materialistic. Okay. Try not to be so materialistic because even in this world, and unfortunately we live in a world where like some people are obsessed with the clothes, the latest phone, the latest clothes, the latest cards, the latest this, the latest system, the latest that, the latest everything, okay? Unfortunately, all right? Some people don't care about stuff like that, okay? But some people do, all right? But remember, Scorpio, people, there's people out there who only care about what who you are as a person, or your personality, your moral standards, stuff like that. Like me, I don't care about the stuff that you have or don't have, you know? I care, I judge you based on your character, your moral standards, your personality, okay? And not only that, if we have the similar dislikes and likes, you know, if we understand each other, if we vibe, then I will be attracted to that, okay? But I'm not going to be attracted to your shoes or your clothes or your car and stuff like that, your, your makeup or your, your, you know, whatever you got or your haircut or whatever you want to, you know, what do you call it? Want to call, want to, whatever you want to put on, okay? I'm not attracted to that. I'm attracted to your character. You understand? You didn't need that kind of mental clarity. The hermit. Okay. All right. So, Scorpio, you're searching for advice from a trusted friend. Okay. You like you're trying to get that person's attention, but they're not really responding. So you're asking around for some advice. And some people, you're getting mixed responses. Some people are just like, oh, if you want to impress them, then you need to get making sure you show off this or that or other. And then there's some other people saying, hey. Just talk to them. Just be a normal human being and talk to them. Say, tell them how you feel. Tell them that you want to get to know them and da 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 All right? So you're kind of flipping a coin with that one because you like both ideas. You like both ideas, but at the same time, you still feel like money and social status, status is the way to go. The high Prius. All right? You know? And you def so it's one thing to get answers and advice from other people, okay? But... Maybe you should really get someone you 110% trust, okay? Or, like, maybe it could be somebody a little bit older than you and has experience, more experience in certain situations, okay? Because anybody around your age could say whatever they think, okay? But somebody older than you might have a little bit more experience in that field, okay? The Nine of Cups, right? Sorry. So, it turns out that your person does like you. Okay, they do like you, okay? But they're not interested in your clothes and your obsessions for money and social status, okay? They want to grow with you because they like your personality and your character, and the, you know? And they like how your face looks, <laughs> you know? But they also like your character, your characteristic traits and your personality, and they, they're attracted to that, okay? So you should let them know the person who you are. Let them know who you are as a person and not the clothes that you have on your body. And our last card says the emperor, okay? 
because you're already wise, strong, and successful. You know, you're already an, a kind, courteous person. You're already interesting and have a lot to say. So let them know that Scorpio, okay? Let them know that person. Let them know that Scorpio behind the clothes and the cars and all that stuff like that, all right? So Scorpio, I hope this did resonate with you. I hope I helped in any way. I hope I brought knowledge or enlightenment to the situation. I hope, you know, um, it just helped. <laughs> I just hope it didn't help in any way. But if it, did not, if it did not resonate with you, I do apologize. Hopefully the next Scorpio reading will. But in the meantime, make sure you guys like, comment, share, 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 subscribe, 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 and hit that post notification bell so you don't miss an upload for when I upload. This has been The Universe, Tarot. Namaste. Thank you.